Alrighty, starting off today's episode, it seems our lords want to attack the Southern Empire again. Uh, I mean, okay. Yeah, it seems like not everyone's for it, but we have, like, such a huge numbers advantage. And also, I think they're at war with the Kuzates as well, so now is the time to just wipe them off the map, I guess. Sadly, uh, there is one thing I do want to mention. Uh, it has been a while since, uh, the last time <laughs> we were here, and the Kuzates have basically taken all of the land that the Southern Empire took, so we won't be, we won't be able to take all that stuff, but at the very least we can go take maybe a few of these towns, maybe all of them, who knows. Anyways, uh, I'll see you in the next battle. Alrighty, starting off, we're attacking Bostrom. Uh... It's pretty well defended. I think there were like maybe 400 troops here, maybe 500. I wasn't really sure. I just kind of joined in randomly. And uh, they do have like, I think of, we have like 1,500 troops here, so we should be fine. Ow, okay, ow, that hurt. Uh, I guess the crossbow omen hit me. Yeah, even with good armor, those things really hurt. Do a better an archer. Oh boy. Hopefully, I don't get shot by my old man. There we go. Going one down. Oh, that's a hard shot to hit. Okay, let's just go for the easier shot. Ow, fuck. Ooh, that one hurt. Let's see, how close are our men? Okay, they're almost up here. Man, I'd like to survive to see the end of one of these tower battles. But I doubt that'll happen this time. There goes our siege tower. That one down. These crossbowmen are the worst to deal with. Oh damn, he survived that. Dang. Siege tower is almost here. I did not mean to shoot that shot. Oh well. Let's see how many of they killed. Killed about. They only killed one of us. Knocked out about 45 though. Oh. That's a bit unfortunate. Yeah, they have a really nice wide open spot there. Oh my... Bro, who shot me? Someone up here? I guess we'll probably... No, they... I guess kind of... I guess when the infantry like out of luck with spirit though. Damn. Well, that's unfortunate. But they should be able to break through here. We have mostly all the troops. I uh, lost a good portion of the cataphract though, so that sucks. Yeah, that's what's going through this lot. Oh boy. This is a very red thing. Oh well, not much you can do. We're kidding the fact. Alright, they're up the ladders now, so they should be able to attack them soon enough. 
Uh, no, no, we did this, man. Uh, Honestly, I love this how the Empire's colors. I really wish they let us have purple <laughs> as a banner option, but sadly, that's not possible. Oh well. Let's see what I threw up. Let's see, we lost nine men. Eight of them were elite cat decks, so that's, that sucks. In any case, there we go. Alrighty, then we'll just send troops in for the rest of that. There we go. And do they have any good ones? Imperial Elite and Abion, so we'll take those. And the Palpatine Guard, and we need to go ahead and replace those we lost. Oh, uh, we'll take four cataphracts. Take the four legionaries. And who should we take for the last guy? Uh, I guess we can take a heavy lancer. There we go. Seems all good. And we got a standard to this one. Uh, I think that's actually better than... Let's see, do we have anyone that has a particularly bad... A therapeutic? You don't really have a good one. Uh, here, you can have that. There we go. That looks good now. And we'll go ahead and show mercy. There we go. They, they decided to give Volstrom to Baranor, which is uh, fair enough since we screwed him out of Huntsfold. Alrighty, so the file for this recording got uh, corrupted, but we managed to take Pyacon on. It had about 600 troops in it. We had 2,700. It was a fairly easy win. In any case, now uh, I think we're gonna go ahead and defend Morinia Castle. Probably won't show that since I doubt they have anything strong over there. In case next time, uh, I'm gonna see if I can take on Lycaron. They probably have a large garrison there, and then Poros. And after that, we should be done with the Southern Empire. Already, if we're taking Lycaron, we have about 2,000 troops versus their 500, or well, close to 600. And this should be a fairly easy win. And after this is just Poros, and we'll have taken out the entire Empire, or well, Southern Empire. Ooh, they have really tall walls here, though. It's gonna be hard getting shots off, but we'll see what we can do. Yeah, this is a rough one. Still get. Yeah, I can still get those who run up the stairs. Hard to get anyone else though. Oh, I got the ones over here. That is if they don't shoot me. There we go, there's one. Oh my god, this group does not like me. Alright, maybe I might want to chill back a bit. Oh, the battering ram is not doing well. Shield tower is doing even worse. They already took down the two tower. Oh boy. Oh, is that not a person? Bro, I feel it. Oh, that's a dead body. <laughs> Alright, batting ram should be safe once it's past this building. That won't be in that one's line of fire anymore. Oh boy. Man, this, this siege is actually pretty tough. Time to go head back over there. Oh boy. <laughs> what 
whatever. So as soon as we get the batting ram up here, we'll be fine. Oh my god. Jeez, the archers are really doing a number on us. Uh, let's get in there. This place should be pretty safe. At least we won't get hit by a catapult here. <laughs> Gate's almost done. One more should do it. I'm on board. There we go. Oh, but <laughs> Oh, well. I was really low on health, so not much I can do there. I think I should be able to make sure you out of here. There's enough people. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, they're already breaking through really fast. Might slow things down a bit to watch it that happen. Let's see. Yeah, the gate's already fully down. Killed about... We actually killed about... We actually killed more of us. Damn. Well, actually, wait, no, we killed more, but it's really close. Yeah, they're holding the walls really well, surprisingly. All things considered. Probably save a lot of crossbowmen here. Those guys are really good in sieges. Luckily, we do have numbers on our side, so... That does make up for it quite a bit. Yeah, it seems like they're mostly running now. Yeah, not much they can do to stop us now. So back to the end of the Oh, there's a nice line battle going on over here. Oh, jeez. Uh. Oh, they have an Az right here? Wow. Traitor. <laughs> Talking like I'm, I'm like an asteroid emperor. <laughs> I mean, I think that like about two thirds of our lords are asteroid, so that's more or less true at this point. Let's see. Yeah. See what I'm falling around. Oh, they already done. Ooh, they killed like 200 of us. Only six lost though, so that's fair enough. Let's go ahead and send troops for the rest. There we go. That's all done. Uh, not really anything I want though. We'll go ahead and recruit prisoners to go ahead and make up for the numbers we lost. Let's see, we'll take, uh, I, I guess the heavy lancers. That works well enough. And done. Uh, not really much in terms of loot, but oh well, what can you expect? We had to share it with like all of our lords. And let's see if we can get this group over here. Ooh, no. Nope. Come on, we're almost there. There we go. Up for Philios. And we'll just send troops for this. There we go. Only lost like two people, that's nice. And we got some good relationship with them. And honestly, just to level up charm, you can go. Oh, you're a prisoner though. You got the Emperor. I was actually, I'm surprised we actually got that. Uh, looks like they've taken out a few of our guys. Uh, we can take the cataphracts. Don't really have room for anyone right now. Sucks, because I actually want more cataphracts. Uh, we can get rid of some. Get rid of these, uh... Get rid of the veteran archer. Get rid of... Uh, the chosen wolf. He's like a meme unit, so we'll keep him. Yeah, we'll take the 
for the two cataphracts. Yeah, that's good. And that all seems about right. Alrighty, it's time for the final town of Southern Empire, Poros. We actually have the Archon that has Poros in here. Sadly, he didn't want to turn, but after this, we should be able to recruit him since he won't have any peeps anymore. Or hopefully, he might be one of those guys who are loyal no matter what. It would suck, but eh, it's whatever. Let's see, any archers want to stick their heads over the wall? Oh, there is a volunteer. Oh, miss. There's a shot. Oh, boy. Come on, stick your head a bit over the wall. There we go. Got his head. Whatever, he'll just die to one shot. Oh boy, they're coming after me. Okay. Might need to chill out a bit. Let's see, any easy shots? Maybe this place? Nope, no one here. Or at least no one. It's easy to get. Jeez. They really have. I think they've upgraded the town here to wall level 3, because I cannot get any easy shots. Oh, there's some easy shots. Everybody, we do have crossbow men here, uh, focusing me. to back up. Okay, this has been fun and all, but... Oh my god, the batting ram's not even close to being up there yet. Yeah. And we might actually lose our batting ram. Okay. That means we'll have to use one lighter. Hopefully it won't come to that. And the Southern Empire has been making a really good... Uh, how do I say it? I don't know defense, like, they're in a hopeless situation, but they're still remaining strong. Let's take care of any crossbowmen. Crossbowmen are gonna do... be a big pain for us. Oh, I see you in there. You're the one that's shooting me in the back. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Like, our is literally crimson red. All this blood. Alright, battering ram's almost up. Let's try to take out a few of my guys. Like, you, you're not allowed to aim at my guys. Maybe you can. I'm gonna get shot before I kill you. There we go. I'll see a crosswoman. Yeah, you're not allowed to do that. Die. You can die too, bro. Oh, oh, there we go. I'm down now. Yeah, not much I can do there. A lot of crossbowmen. There we go. Oh boy, that's a lot of red, but. Won't really matter in the end. Let's see how the ladder is doing. Oh, they're already up. <laughs> oh, they're already up. Jesus Christ. Okay. Ladder's doing great. How about get gates? They're actually holding the gate pretty well, surprisingly. Looks like they're sending most of their forces up to the... Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a big mistake. You want to hold the gate. 
But they're gonna break through this in like a matter of moments. Yeah, it's just a matter of time. Or maybe they won't, like... They're actually holding this lot better than I thought they would. Oh, oh, there's the first sign of weakness. Oh, oh, I might actually... Oh, oh, they're actually doing it really well. Yeah, they're actually gonna... Oh, never mind, they're starting to run. Oh, there's... There comes the reinforcements. Okay, gate. I managed to hold the gate, but... The ladder's still over here. This is like... Yeah, they're just cutting down it. <laughs> they're just cutting down anyone that tries to come to the ladder. They're just chilling over there. Let's see, do we have any reinforcements coming? Yes we do. Oh my god. And they foolishly decided to come outside of the gate. That's just that's just that's never a good idea. <laughs> Let's see. Oh we only have two people defending the gate now. Oh god. Oh boy. Yeah, this is gonna be a massacre now. We're just gonna go ahead and do a pincer attack. Actually, they'll probably be dead before they can even pincer attack. Yeah, they're all coming downstairs now. Oh, oh, they're getting stabbed in the back. Oh god. Okay. Yeah, this is rough. Yeah, I think we all know this is gonna end. Trying to speed this up. How's this going over here? What a death. Nothing out of the ordinary. There we go. Golden Empire killed like 200 of us. We got 666 kills. Nice. Nice. The new one. Oh, fuck. That's one of. That one of our guys. I, I swear I didn't. Oh no, that's that's an imperial noble. Hey, nice. That's one noble dead. He killed like 25 people. Wow. Oh, okay. Uh, I guess he kind of deserves that. I mean, good. I mean, I guess she was a Nasserai trader, so might as well kill her. Let's see. Diaska, uh, you can go. Might as well get some relations up. Let's see. Guess we'll recruit from our guys. Let's see, what do we have? Mm. Take the Torgans, I guess. Then we'll recruit or upgrade who we can. And that's good enough. And don't really need any of that. Yeah, as you know, sight in battle. Yeah, that's that's gonna be a blow to the Southern Empire. Owner of Lycaron. Uh, who wants it? You do? Yeah, you're Imperial. Sure, you can have it. Whew. Yep, that's... And I think that's the end of the Southern Empire. I don't think they have any more <laughs> chiefs. Yeah, let me just look. Real fast, so if we go up here, yep, they do not have a single other thing. But we will have to go defend Lycanron, but we didn't leave any garrison there, so it's probably just one dude attacking. Alright, dude, now with the fall of the Southern Empire, we're essentially, I think, probably the number one power in the world right now. We control the southeast quadrant of the map. Western Empire is smack dab in the middle. Uh, I think we have territory bordering everyone now, except the Sturgeons and the Batanians. The Vlandians can still go to war to us because of these three thieves. And honestly, I might just sacrifice these thieves, except for Unsat Castle. I'd rather Unsat Castle not fall since that lord doesn't have any more thieves after that. But the other two have more or less been indoctrinated over 
and areas over here. And let's see. That's actually let's go to diplomacy. We can actually look at the strength of Poros once. Oh boy. Ah, they want to give Poros over to an Asurai. That's yeah. All right. We just can have that. I guess. I mean, we'll figure something out with that one. We might have to get a companion to become a new lord, but we'll deal with that in a moment. So, Northern Empire is doing, well, bad. Then we have the Southern Empire, who, oh, their the total strength has got, what was that, like 2,000 <laughs> at 651? Our strength hasn't really gone down any since the start of this war. They do have one prisoner. Who on earth do they take prisoner? Wuhan. Damn it, Wuhan. Well, meanwhile, we have like uh, literally everything. So yeah, we we're actually pretty set right now. Let's see. So compared to the Western Empire, they're still a slightly bit stronger than us, but like they're fighting the Blandian army <laughs> empire right now. Which is, uh, the se was the second strongest, but they have really fallen far. Like, they were at 10,000, now they're at 10,000. What happened? Oh, I guess they spread themselves a bit. Far. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, so this was all Vlandian territory before, but now it seems like the Western Empire has taken all of that. Jeez, the war over here is going crazy. And. It makes me glad that we've just been fighting all this, the weaker factions and not the superpowers of the world. Alright, to be honest, I didn't quite like where the Crusades campaign left off last time. So, now that the Crusades just declared war on us, I guess we can go ahead and finish them off. That's cool. Ooh boy, now the, now the Western Empire has also declared war on us. I guess us becoming the powerhouse of the world is, uh, really, they didn't really like that. So, uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and end off today's episode here. Is I think fighting a two-front war will be a good start for the next episode. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, go ahead and leave a like and subscribe, or don't. I don't care. <laughs> Anyways, have a nice day.